Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Billionaire Mukesh Ambani runs one of the biggest companies in the world, but his focus is still on his children, Akash, Isha, and Anant. The Reliance Industries chairman worked his way up in his family's business after his father pulled him out of Stanford University, where he was studying for his master's in business. Mukesh went on to make a fortune through his company and has held the title of the richest person in India, per Forbes, for over a decade. In 1985, Mukesh married his wife Nita Ambani and the two soon welcomed their first children, twins Akash and Isha, on October 23, 1991. Their youngest son, Anant, was born four years later on April 10, 1995. In March 2024, Anant's pre-wedding celebrations attracted a star-studded guest list including Mark Zuckerberg and Bill Gates, as well as their partners, and a performance by Rihanna. Though his wedding to fiancé Radhika Merchant was set for July 2024, the A-listers joined the happy couple for a three-day celebration in the luxurious Ambani estate in Gujarat, India. Three months later, Anant kicked off his wedding celebrations with an even more starry guest list, including Kim and Khloe Kardashian, Nick Jonas, Priyanka Chopra and John Cena. Justin Bieber also performed for the guests. From their roles in the family business to their weddings, here's everything to know about Mukesh Ambani's kids, Akash, Isha and Anant. Mukesh and Nita's first son, Akash, was born on October 23, 1991, alongside his twin sister Isha in Mumbai. After attending international school in Mumbai, Akash moved to the U.S. to study at Brown University, graduating in 2014 with a bachelor's in economics. He went on to join his family's company, Reliance, the same year. Akash spoke about how his father inspired him when choosing a career at the IIT Bombay Tech Fest in December 2023. My father is one of my biggest inspirations and heroes, he said. He always wanted me to be an engineer. Full disclosure I'm not an engineer. I've been obsessed with technology since my father got his first phone in late 2003. I always think that you make life out of inspirations and I was lucky to have my inspirations right at my house in terms of my grandfather, my mother and my father, he added. As of 2022, Akash serves as the chairman of Reliance Geo Infocom Limited. In his role, Keith spearheads the creation of products and services that leverage new age technologies like 5G, artificial intelligence, blockchain, and the Internet of Things to bring about a generational shift in commerce, education, and healthcare across India, per the company's website. During his talk at the tech conference, Akash said that running a business is like always being in the driver's seat of a car and he couldn't let any distractions get in the way. Despite the stress, though, he said he enjoyed his work. I've always said that if you really don't enjoy it, then you're not going to get there, he said. Don't be afraid of failure. I think that's something that I'm lucky that my parents have been able to guide us and say that it's okay if you fail, it's important to recognize when it happens and take those steps to really change that quite quickly and course correct. In March 2019, Akash married his wife Shloka Mehta in a large ceremony, with a performance by Chris Martin. The attendees included Bollywood stars like Shah Rukh Khan and Ali Abhat, per Vogue India. Akash's twin sister, and Mukesh and Nita's only daughter. Isha was also born on October 23, 1991. Like Akash, she also attended college in the U.S., graduating from Yale University in 2013 with a degree in psychology and South Asian studies. She then went on to earn her MBA at Stanford University in 2018. She also joined the family business and now serves as a member of the Board of Reliance's various branches, per her bio on the company's website. Though she told Vogue Australia that she once had aspirations to be a teacher, she added that she always knew that she would contribute to Reliance in some way. My parents raised me with very traditional values, and it was ingrained in me from an early age that family should always come first, she told the outlet in July 2017. I've always believed that part of my personal responsibilities towards my family extends professionally as well. Isha added that as the only woman in her family involved with the company, she felt it was important to.